just got in from the horses and we've noticed that a mound has appeared under one of our exes. So we just see We had to pack the Garden Monster camp away yesterday because there was a big thunderstorm, wasn't there cats? So let's have a look and see what the garden looks like. Oh my goodness, I can see already. The Garden Monster has been doing his absolute worst. Look, there's bits all over. Look, there's a little hole there. And then if we come over to where the two main crosses were, we've got one, two, three, four, five, I think that's two, six and seven more holes. This is an absolute nightmare. Isn't it, Cat? Isn't it, Boo Boo? So what we'll do again today is we'll start, <clears throat> start from scratch. We'll flatten all the holes. We'll do an X marks the spot and then see whether or not we can catch him. I've just finished patting all of the molehills down and bugger me another one's come up. Look at that. Why is it never there? We're not even after killing it, we just want to give it a nice new home so it stops digging up ours. 
No, it's not there. I can't see it. No. Nothing at all. Oh, well, we'll wait again and see if we can catch it. I don't know where it goes to. So here we are. We are taking a break from the mole, being as though we cannot catch it. And we have tried, haven't we? We have really tried to catch the mole. Yeah. So we have come out for a ride. I've got baby pony walking, haven't we, baby pony? Because I need the exercise and I need to walk. And then we've got William and old man Bobo over there. And we're just going to do about a mile, two miles, aren't we? Just for a little bit of exercise. And then we'll go back and see if we can catch them all. Hi guys, and we're now back from the ride. And we're on our way back home to catch them all. Hello everybody, and welcome to today's vlog. Unfortunately, we still have not caught the mole. We've seen it a couple of times, haven't we? We've got it on camera a couple of times and we still cannot catch it. So yesterday we tried water bombs, we tried the Nerf gun, we tried digging it out, and we've just tried everything apart from killing it because that's not what we want to do, but we've tried everything else. So join us again today and what we're going to try and do is some more tricks to try and get it out of the ground and then we can see if we can get it in the bucket and then we can relocate it can't we? Mm -hmm. okay. Not gonna kill it! So anyway, stay with us and we'll see if we can catch it. Oh so here we are and we're trying to do the same as what we did yesterday which is with the water bombs to try and bring the uh, garden monster out aren't we? Yes. But they keep popping the water balloons. Oh that's nowhere near good away for the uh, X's. Go for the orange X's. Okay. Oh nearly. More muscles. Oh no everything's got wet. I'm wet. Hey. Aww. Go on then, last one. Chuck the last one. Wanger it over to the garden. Oh, let's see if that brings it out. Why don't you go and dump the water on its head? Over there at the main one near the kennel. Go and stick it on its head. Go on. And now, I guess, we just have to wait and see, don't we? Oh, we're giving it a dab. And we are just in from swimming. We have only been out an hour and the mole has made two more appearances. There's a bulb in the ground there where it's come out and then over here there is a crack where it's clearly been coming up. And there's also a hole there. There is also a little hole over there, yeah. So, what I was going to do is just see what is under these, whether or not there's actually a mole run, so we can see which direction it goes in. What about if it came from there? Do you oh, want to hold the camera, darling, for Mommy, me? Mommy, what? So, Amy, can, can I move the camera a sec? Keep it upright, otherwise people will get dizzy. Can I move it? Can I move it around a sec? So what I'm trying to say is, the mole could have come from that way, it could have moved, ran along here, and then ran along there, it could have gone that way, and ran along here, is what I'm trying to say. So like it has its own little assault course? Yes, yeah, so and then it tries to trick us. It just, oh, I've hit something hard there. We just never know where it is or where it's going to come out. Our lawn is no more. If that is the last mole, we'll have to buy some more grass to lay down. It is. Yes, when we do finally catch the mole, we'll definitely need some more grass seed because that is awful. Awful grass. And we have just realised that we have a massive colony of ants that have come in the garden. That's disgusting. Flying ants. The whole place is crawling with them. 
So we're just going to go get the ant powder now to do something about that because that is just horrific. Absolutely awful. Ugh. So it's starting to turn dark again. The uh, sun is going down so what we've decided to do is just do X marks the spot again so we'll know if the ground has been disturbed. Won't we, dear? I think you have to hold the can more upright for it to come out. That's better. And across. Ooh, that's neon orange. Because these are the two main holes. And over there, William, on the one next to the kennel. Got all kinds of plastic in there as well from the water bombs, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Go on and give it a spray. Not... And across. And across. Fantastic. Right, we will leave those and see whether or not they get disturbed in the next couple of hours. Shall we, William? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Come on then, let's get inside. Do we need our den? Well, yeah, inside our den. Even though the cats have decided that they're going to use our den as well. Hey, Ike. You should be catching them all, Ike. Shouldn't you? It's nearly 10 o'clock at night and there's the cats. We're just doing a final check on our exes to see whether or not there's been any movement. Has there been any movement, boo-boo? So looking at that one. No, no movement on that one. Over here. No. No movement there. And that X is fine as well. So what we'll have to do is check again in the morning and see if we can finally get that elusive garden monster. So it's seven o'clock in the morning, isn't it? Mm -hmm. We're going to check our X's. We were out here at very late last night, about 10 o'clock. That X hasn't been touched. That X hasn't been touched. Please excuse the dog poop. We haven't tidied that up yet. Let's have a look over here. Are you coming, William? Well, that one doesn't look touched, but that one has got a crack on it. So whether or not the sun's dried it... Oh my gosh, there's one there, look. Mm. There's one actually there that's come up, and it looks to be one over there as well. I wonder how long that one's been up for. Ah, uh, that's been up for quite a while. What, this morning? How do you know? We've only just got up. I mean, I know it's come up there before and we've patted it back down, but that's a completely new one on me. Right. It's the small one, I think. Pesky thing. So what are we going to do now? Is it time for drastic action? Yes. Right, let's do it.